A new survey shows that Florida has more lead pipes than any other state in the country. Experts say they didn't see this coming. Washington's Megan Milano spoke with an expert who says lead can be extremely dangerous. What was your initial reaction when you saw the survey? Well, my initial reaction was we were really glad that the EPA updated its formula, the way that it allocates the money. Senior policy advocate with the Natural Resources Defense Council, Cindy Roper, says the Environmental Protection Agency survey on lead pipes that came out Tuesday reallocates money to remove those pipes, distributing it more proportionately to the states that need it. And so that was my first reaction was one of being pleased that they updated the formula. That's something that we had been asking for, and we were glad to see that. But then there were some surprises, and I would have to say that Florida was the biggest surprise. The survey shows the number of lead pipes per state. Florida came out on top with nearly 1.2 million, a shocking number to experts like Roper who say lead can have significant health impacts, especially to children. In children, it can impact uh, have behavior and learning problems. It can lower IQ, have impact um, hyperactivity, slow growth, hearing problems, those types of things. And then with adults, it can also cause cardiovascular uh, problems, um, kidney problems, and it can impact reproductive uh, ish health in both men and women. More money will now be provided to the Sunshine State to get the pipes removed. Roper says the goal is to have all the lead pipes in the country gone in the next 10 years. Megan Mulatto, Wash 2 News.